And in a related story, a hunger strike by former DPP Chairman Linny Shung is among several factors that contributed to concessions from the KMT on the fourth nuclear power plant. Today was the seventh day of Lin's strike. Visibly weakened, he left the protest site to get treatment at the National Taiwan University Hospital. For the first time since the start of his hunger strike one week earlier, Lin Yishong left the church where he has been staying to pray to his ancestors in Ilan. In the afternoon, upon returning to Gikong Church, Lin needed help to walk. His energy was all but gone. At 3 p.m., Lin left the church again to head to National Taiwan University Hospital. Mr. Lin gives the utmost thanks to everyone for the attention and hard work they have put into watching over him. Mr. Lin has gone to the hospital for treatment. Once his physical condition has improved, he will formally offer thanks to everyone. Supporters cried upon seeing the 72-year-old Lin. At the hospital, Lin received treatment, including an IV, and underwent examinations. <laughs> 